Alrighty, everybody, so I made it back to the route that we just came from, and uh, I had to blast to a boulder to the right, and that was it. Uh, this is the route where we uh, previously left off on, where the trial is up super north in the cave, and then it's the four train of trial on that route as well. But we're going to talk to this guy. This guy's going to give us our last thing that we can do within the Pokemon Sun and Moon demo, and he's going to take us to a, a little secret location where the professor is chilling and killing, and guess what? Of course, just like every other Pokemon game, you gotta learn how to catch a Pokemon. So the Professor, but what's good about this one, is this guy knows what he's doing. It's not like the Magikarp looking dude from Red and Blue, where he don't, he don't, he don't capture shits. If you haven't noticed, through every generation in Pokemon video games, it's gotten better and better. This guy knows where it's at. He actually damages the Peaky Peck with his Rock Ruff and then captures it. You know what's coming in the next uh, uh, generation in Pokemon? The guy's probably going to show us by sleeping the Pokemon or poisoning or paralyzing it and then throwing a Pokeball. Uh, let me know what you guys think because I bet you I'm correct because it has been every single generation getting better and better. But the point of this is not what we're watching right now, not the professor showing us how to capture a Pokemon. I've been playing the game for 20 years. I know how to capture a Pokemon, son. The point of this is we got... A cool little side quest. A cool little... I got hiccups. Why? A cool little side um, quest. A cool little side trial that we get to do here within these patches of grass that we can see where the uh, professor's capturing this little peaky peck. This guy that brought us here wants us to capture as many Pokemon as we can and he's going to give us an item. This is another item that we get to send to our full version of the Pokemon Sun and Moon game. So, what sucks is we don't get to keep any of these Pokemon. So, if you just keep capturing Pokemon, you don't get to keep them. You, get, you have to send them back to the wild. What also sucks is, if you capture more than three, it's just completely useless. You have to capture at least three in order to get the, uh, the item that this guy's going to give to you. So, the first one that we're going to go after is a Peaky Pack. I'm going to go ahead and use a Great Ball. Uh, usually, when you play Pokemon, the first Pokemon that you throw a Pokeball at is usually a 100% catch rate. Uh, without even damaging it or doing anything. And I just wanted to make sure by using a Poke uh, Great Ball. So I'm kind of lazy here. I don't want to do any damaging effects. And uh, yeah, I want to make sure I get this through quickly. So we got a Peaky Peck. And we're going to go ahead and travel through the grass to see if we can get two more Pokemon. We can get two more Pokemon, but I, I got to go get two more Pokemon. Uh, so that we did the top grass. Now we're going to go ahead and do the bottom grass, see if there's anything different down here. But guess what? No, there isn't anything different. We got another goddamn Peaky Peck. I'm starting to get sick of these guys. Don't get me wrong. They're cool. But I'm getting sick of them. So I'm going to be lazy here and uh, just just throw a Pokeball without damaging it. Because that's, that's just how I do. Hopefully I am Gucci here. Hopefully it captures it within the first try. Uh, we got one ball. We got two rolls. And we got three. And it is captured. So that is two out of the three that I want to capture. The reason why I'm not going over three is because, again, it's pointless. And you can get an item by only capturing three of these Pokemon. So... Might as well do that. So, we're going to stay down here and try to get one more Pokemon. And let's go ahead and check it out what it is, guys. What do you guys think it is? Oh, what? It's a Peaky Peck. No way. Okay, so bear with me. I just found three Peaky Pecks. Well, I've done this demo a couple times. Again, like I said, you can find the other Pokemon here. You can find Rockruff and Young Goose here as well. So, you won't get this bad of a luck. And guess what? This third Peaky Peck gave me so much bad luck. I threw a Pokeball, and it didn't work on the first try. I did three Shake and Bakes, and just gave me the middle finger. I was like, really, bro? I don't want to damage you. Just just, just come with me. I'll let you free. Let me go get my item, bro. So I throw another Pokeball, thinking, all right, so he, he just messing with me in the first try. He messing. But no. He's like, bro, you're not getting me, bro. So I'm glad you used Growl to lower my attack. Because I was always afraid if I did any damaging moves, it'll die. Look at this Night Slash. It left it at 1 HP. Without the Growl, without lowering my attack, I would have had some hell here. So, now that it's at 1 HP, we can go ahead and throw the, uh, the Pokeball. And it should be a 99.9% .9 catch rate guarantee on this little B. And it, it, I don't even know if it was a female, so I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And uh, we got it. So, that is three Peaky Pecks. Uh, that is three Pokemon caught on this route. And that is three for the trial completed. 
So what am I going to call this trial? The the capture for no reason trial. Um, but there is a reason because this guy's going to give us a, a nice little item. So he's cheering for us, but I'm like, bro, I'm out because I know what you're going to make me do. You're going to make me release all these Pokemon. So I'm going to stop from this trial and uh, I'm going to give him all, show him all the Pokemon that we've caught. I caught three. He's going to give us a nugget to send to our Pokemon Sun and Moon game. So besides Greninja, that's probably the best thing that we've gotten thus far. So without further ado, again, thank you very much for tuning in. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. And uh, stay tuned for some more For the Win Itachi content. And stay tuned for some more Pokemon Sun and Moon content brought to you by For the Win Itachi. Again, thank you very much for tuning in. For the Win Itachi is out.